Bengals, Browns, NFL pick here Monday. Wide receiver Chase out for the Bengals with a defensive tackle out and a quarterback doubtful. Cleveland starting tight end and right guard out on defense. Their left corner is out with the linebacker and right corner questionable. Cincinnati improves a 4-3 and three after their 35-17 home win to Atlanta Falcons. Uh, as they hit the bye, Bengals posted a season high at 537 yards, 78 rushing on 21 carries <clears throat> on defense. They limit the Falcons just over three yards a carry, 107 passing yards on 13 attempts. Joe Burrow, season highs here, 81% completions, 481 yards passing, <clears throat> 11 yards per attempt in that one. Yeah, he threw for three touchdowns. Now on the season, Burrow, 69% completions, 7.8 yards per attempt. Now Cleveland fell to 2-5. A 23-20 road defeat at Baltimore in this divisional battle. The Browns moved the football for 336 yards, 113 rushing on 24 carries. Defensively, they held the Ravens under 4 yards per rush, 94 passing yards on 16 attempts. Jacoby Brissett, season highs here, 81% completions, 9.6 yards per attempt. He passed for 258 yards in, the, in this one. This season, Brissett, 63% completions, 6.8 yards per attempt. Browns have been competitive in four losses, losing by three or fewer points. Cleveland is running the ball for 5.2 yards to carry, and the Bengals are giving up 4.6 yards per rush. Bengals' offense on the road has averaged just 305 yards, and the Browns 388 at home. Not an easy environment here uh, for Cincinnati in this venue in primetime. They're allowing three and a half sacks per game on the road, and the Browns do a good job in pass protection in their home stadium play. Here will be Cleveland at plus three.